Hello guys, what's up? My name is Midway and welcome to this video where we are looking at how to kill Tredova on Tyrannical Keys as a Holy Paladin in the patch 9.2, also happening to play Necrolord. So very noticeable here before we say anything, we are running a 5 melee comp, meaning we are very, 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 uh, like we are profiting very much from just Light of Dawn in general. And our healing is way easier than it would usually be So in the case that you have like one or two range. And the more, the worse it's gonna be for uh, Holy Paladin playing Necro. Now, in this fight in particular, especially in this setup of this kind of comp, it's really, really, really gonna make the fight way easier if you are able to just stack up all the melee, stack up in front of the boss, uh, of course, here moving out of the air, and just baiting all the circles in one big puddle, and all, and, and all moving out at the same time. It just makes the world of a difference. The fight just it's a completely different fight guys it just falls over it's just way way quicker and this is not rocket science but it's like really the first time that we've ever been able to play this as five melee the fact the ground links always come to melee everything's just like so much cleaner guys it's just so uh, it's so 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 clean i can't stress enough fights like this one and like nile thor the last boss in necrotic wake stacking up as a full melee comp makes things just way easier and yeah, just you can just see, we barely ever panic about the circles, if anything, because they're just not a thing. You just move out at the same time, and so long as never, nobody falls asleep, this boss will never be an issue of like running out of space or uh, just having the ads all over the place and having to stack them up. The only thing is like sometimes people have to move out with uh, the mind link, I think it's called. The thing that you have to just break the link, moving out of uh, everybody else from range. Uh, if that happens and somebody is not able to get back into melee, they might as well just play the swirly by themselves away from melee. And that way, that's just not going to be interfering with uh, the way the other melee are moving. And uh, yeah, that's really on the only situation where doing it like this is, is kind of... Could be a little bit risky if somebody's just running in melee, just like as that's happening, the swirls are coming out and they're like late and whatever. But besides that, look at this, we're just moving out, chilling, like, nothing's going on. If this is the case for you, what can I say? Like, look at this, we're taking no damage, the link is just broken instantly there because the hunter was real quick, and uh, the adds are coming to us. Now, whenever we hit the last phase, the adds will always come on to us, the healers, right? So, something we can do is uh, just use a bop, and uh, that way no, no damage is taken. You can also use it on other people in the previous phases, but it's probably just going to be better to save it for the end because, well, usually this is not going to be as clean as you see it here, right? So these ads will probably take way longer to die usually, and of course you have pop as well. And we don't really know what happened there. I think all the ads died at the same time, and they, they just happened to just cleave us all with uh, their damage. So we barely almost died there, but yeah, you can see it's as clean as it gets. Use your personal, use Debo if you even need it on these guys, but the damage really only is going to happen in the intermissions. The big AoE damage will really only happen in those scenarios in the intermission whenever you're just supposed to interrupt as soon as possible as well. So other than that, this is so clean. Everybody's in the same range, so breaking the mind link is very, very, very easy and it's like, like everybody's going to get it broken at the same time. So very little damage will be taken but that's it guys hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you on the next one bye bye